granola, bitches. Uh, Bilbo Bergens. My wifey has gone gr- granola like a mofo. Since we got married and she's discovered all natural makeups and hair treatments, she has started washing her hair with baking soda and, and oils, leaving her hair stringy and ratty, but according to her, feeling good. Oh, Jesus. Also, she stopped shaving her legs, plucking her eyebrows. She doesn't brush her teeth at night and only showers every other day because she says it's all good for her skin. She's not a fatty and is a great person, but when it comes time to throw down in the boudoir, (laughs) she smells like a sweaty hobo and it makes me grit my teeth. Oh, yeah, dude. He says, I'm certainly not a Kong dong, but she always gets worn out from sex and doesn't recover for days. This guy's fucking hilarious. A Kong dong. All right. Needless to say, even after I tell her she smells crazy, she still does all of this. Oh, so you're telling her that she smells like a fucking a hobo. I love hobo. Hobo's so better, so much better than homeless guy. Hobo, it's like you smell like fucking the depression. You know, you smell like the dust bowl. Um, I'm on the verge of freaking out and going strictly all hand or, le- <laughs> or leaving it or leaving her over it. Um, not sure what to do, and I'm sure you can't cure it, but any feedback would be great. Pine away and go fuck yourself. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, all right, this is what I would do. The next time she wants to have sex, I'd say, hang on a second. No, first, this is what I do. First thing I would do, I would go down to the hardware store and I would buy as many garden hoses as you needed to connect together from the side of the house. All right? Um, or maybe no, that's going to cost you too much money to make your point. The next time she wants to, 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 to throw down, just somehow get her outside and say, yeah, hang on a second and just fucking turn the hose on her. <laughs> Dude, I don't I don't know what to tell you. I I don't I don't know. This is a deal breaker. You got to be like, "Lady, you fucking you smell like fucking 2000 BC. I might as well be fucking you in a cave with a with mully, with a woolly mammoth BVDs on. You smell like you should be holding a spear. How, how else do I put this? You know? You should be squatting down, banging a rock on some berries. That's that's what you fucking... You smell... Your pussy smells prehistoric. Even back in the day, I'm sure... You know, even if I smelled the way I smelled, chasing a saber-toothed tiger across the fucking plains, you know, if you smelled like this, I would drag you down to some prehistoric river and dunk you in there like five fucking times before I bent you over a rock. I'm trying to tell you, you fucking smell... Dude, this is like, that's like disgusting. And as bad as guys can smell, at least our shit can get a little breeze on it. You know? You know what a woman's sm- stinky pussy's like? It's like hockey stuff. It's zipped up in that fucking bag. And when she un- <laughs> if she unzips it, you can smell it from across the room. All right? A guy's fucking smelly junk. I mean, that's like, uh, that's like old fruit on the table flies buzzing around it and shit. It's still disgusting. But you know what I mean? It's not as fucking bad. Look, what's going to smell worse? A dead body laying on the side of the street or one locked in the trunk? All right, if I made my fucking point, hose it down. Hose it fucking down. Dude, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. It's just, I, I, you know what I would do? I would just say, listen, I'm not having sex with you until you wash yourself properly. Okay? They make all kinds of all-natural soaps. There's no excuse for the way you smell right now. You are a fucking train wreck. Jesus Christ, why don't you just start shooting drugs while you're at it to add another level of skeeviness to this? Come here, let me show you something. Look at my dick. You see what it's doing? You see what it's doing right now? It's not interest. It's not finding the floors fascinating. Okay. 
It's depressed right now. That's why it appears to be looking at the, the, the fine grain of our hardwood floors. Look at my dick. Look at it. That's what you do to me. All right? Dude, I don't, I don't know what to tell you. You got to tell her to fucking wash her goddamn ass. You know, I, I would just get like, I would get really passive aggressive. I would get one of those little spray bottles and I would have some perfume in there and not the all natural kind either. No, you know what? You got to be obnoxious. You got to get the old school one that has that little pumper on it and just anytime and, and don't spray it on her. Just anytime she walks by, just spray it. And when she looks at you, just be like, you you smell horribly. And that smell is is it's getting on the love that I, I that I have for you. And every day it's it's like it's like you know what? My love, if you could draw it, looks like the roof on Bill Burr's house. 